Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make a Gary's Mod custom loading screen for your dedicated server. After doing some research, this is the easiest and cheapest way of making one that I have personally found. First thing you're going to want to do is go to this website here. I'll leave a link in the description below. It should say sign in through Steam right here. I'm already signed in, so it says to the dashboard for me. After signing in, you should see this right here. Real quick, I want to show you the price options they offer. Most everything you'll need is offered for free, but if you want it a little more, it's not badly priced. You'll see it's pretty cheap at $1.99 a month or only $9.99 for six months. $20 a year isn't bad for what they offer and it helps keep them in business. The subscription offers no watermark, no ads, which I haven't seen any ads anyway other than the one and it only shows up for the server owner, not people connecting to the server. You also get exclusive layouts and features and a cool dark mode. Plus, it supports them to keep this site active. All right, back to the dashboard. You'll see two pluses. You can have two different loading screens for two different servers if you wanted. Go ahead and click one of the pluses. It'll generate a loading screen for you. Go up here to layout, just choose one you like. I'm gonna keep it at default for me. Here in general details, you can add a title and description and change the loading bar color. And staff members, you can add other mods or admins. By default, it has you as the owner. In rules, you can add custom rules. Music, you can upload your own music or you can use one of their songs already listed. You can also change the language of your server. You can also add background images or use the ones it has provided. If you want your own, you will have to upload them to a site like Imgur and copy the link into those boxes. And lastly, you can change the font of everything. When done, click Save All Changes and you should see this. Firstly, make sure it's to your liking. Click these three dots here and click View Demo. It will have this watermark down here unless you choose to pay the $1.99 a month, but if everything else is to your liking, you can go back and you'll want to take this text right here and copy it. Then you'll want to go to your Gary's Mod server folder. I'm going to use this for my Dark RP server. Go to Steam Apps, Common, Gary's Mod DS, Gary's Mod, CFG, and open the AutoX.CFG. If you don't have one, you can create one by making a text document and naming it AutoX.CFG. Make sure Show All File Extensions is on to change it from a .txt to a .cfg. Once you open it, it may be empty, which is fine. All you have to do is paste the text that you copied into there. Save and exit. Now you can run your server and when you log into your server, you and anyone else who connects should see the custom login screen. When the server owner logs in, if they don't pay the $1.99 a month, they will see this little ad right here that I was talking about, but that's something only you should see and no one else should see connecting to your server. Well, that's it for this how-to. If you liked this video and it helped you create a loading screen, please give it a like and subscribe as it helps my channel grow. If you have anything else you'd like to see, just let me know in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.